rainbow rose in Surrey. A storm was brewing beneath. We are taking time. The scene has since cleared and while clashes were not violent, fighting words were exchanged Monday morning in front of the Surrey RCMP detachment. About 60 people showed up for the rising of the flag, about half of the crowd supporting the display, the other opposed to it. We are at a hateful group. point in we're Canada at a hateful group. where we have one group that gets special privileges, yeah, we are special a hateful rights. Group. It's the first time the local force has flown the pride flag at its building to mark Pride Month. Celebrating Pride is an opportunity for us to reflect on our relationship with the LGBTQ2 plus community as we work towards becoming a more diverse and inclusive organization. 20 years after Pride started, it's absolutely amazing with the relationship that we've had that the RCMP shows that it's unafraid to fly the flag. But not all present at the ceremony were there to celebrate. Opponents calling the flag divisive, not inclusive. The RCMP is supposed to be neutral and they certainly aren't in this. They've gone political and that's a, apart from their mandate, totally. The RCMP is probably the tipping point here when an organization that's supposed to be politically neutral um, starts to give special rights and promotion of one person's political agenda, one group's political agenda, uh, that's an overstepping of boundaries in Canada. And I think Canadians are said, today is the day, enough is enough. The event comes a month after Surrey City Council refused to fly the pride flag at City Hall, saying it would go against its current flag policy. We are hoping in the future we will be accepted, but we're not there yet. And that's why it's so important to have these types of events that support gay and lesbian people and to raise the pride flag because, you know, just look, we still have a lot of people who hate us and who don't like us. The RCMP says the flag will fly every day until the end of the month, but will be taken down at night to prevent vandalism. We have every confidence that the RCMP will reconsider what they're doing. <laughs> In Surrey, Isabel Regan, City News.